Something huge is going on right now in Russia. Putin just went to the Kremlin at 3 a.m. urgently. The last time this happened was on June 25th, nothing public came out of it but this time I think we can figure out what's happening. There's two possibilities. The first possibility and the less scary one is this, tomorrow, the Russian parliament is supposed to make a special statement on Ukraine. The possibility might be that members of the parliament are refusing to vote for or accept whatever Putin told them to say. So Putin would be forced to go in Moscow in person in the middle of the night to strong arm parliament into doing what he wants and he needs to do it now because the statement has to be ready tomorrow or else he will look like a fool. Even if that's not what's happening, I'm kind of scared of what they will say tomorrow. Hopefully it's not full-scale war mobilization because that would be very bad. The other possibility, which is scarier, is that Russian medias are reporting that earlier today, the Speaker of the lower house of the Russian parliament, he's basically like Pelosi in the United States, was nearly killed by Ukrainian long-range artillery. Shells or missiles landed in the building where he was making a speech only seven minutes earlier, he was very lucky to not be killed. But then again what kind of moron goes to a war zone to make a speech in range of enemy artillery? Too bad they missed that war criminal because it would have been a great gift for Ukrainian Independence Day but you can't get lucky every time. It might be completely made up by Russian medias to stir up the pro-war movement at home on Ukraine's birthday but who knows. Let's assume it's real. If this is the case, Ukraine nearly assassinated one of the top Russian politician with American artillery and Putin has to respond to this in some manner. Since he's going to the Kremlin at 3 in the morning, he's probably planning something really bad. Anyway I guess we'll see in the next few hours or days. Peace out.